Oh, I got a lot of money. Look at that. How much is a lot of money? I have 64,000 credits. These things only cost like 4,000 credits. Oh, buy them all. Buy all the things. See, shoulder guard. Sure, why not? You can get a totally overpowered assault rifle just because you can afford $16,000 of upgrades. Yep, that's why I'm Commander nice. Shepard. Because I have money. Oh, the collector armor costs 50000 Although I don't want to use the collector armor. I will take the scale model of the Citadel, though. <laughs> that's the important thing, is to create my ship collection. Wait a minute, what? Edie? Why aren't you on the ship? And why are you nude again? Wait, what? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> why does she why does she wear clothes when we're attacking Eden Prime for no reason, but then oh, out here in society where all the races of the world can see you, you are an unshackled AI and you're nude. <laughs> Seriously, why are you here? <laughs> You look like you're gathering data. Oh gosh. Anything big in Hello, Shepard. Man to humanity to man. Does objective reality exist? That kind of thing. She reminds me of Fee. She does. It's really scary. <laughs> Only she has much better lip syncing than Fee. Oh, so you mean they move? Not stated it to anyone yet. Shepard, you have first-hand sexual experience. What the fuck? Did you just say that? Did you actually just say that? Yes. Yes, she did. I can't believe this is actually a thing. That's why she's here, because Joker is like showing her around the Citadel. Still, I think I see. I think I saw this scene in a video or something. Asking you out. I can't believe he's attracted presence. to the Goram ship AI. Music. What? You know, she was in if she, robot. If she was in a female Volus body, I don't think Joker would be showing her around the <laughs> Citadel. I'm just saying. That's not how to think of it. It's got to be natural. You need chemistry. I see. There are yeah, I've definitely seen this scene before. No, I mean relax and do something you both like. Oh, what the crap! Something simple. <laughs> yeah. Something you both like <laughs> Correct. I will see if there are comedic entertainment shows being presented on the Citadel. Scanning. Do you think he would like the man who hung himself? It appears to be about an amorous plastic surgeon. And again, Commander Shepard just stares. He's. <laughs> he doesn't even he doesn't even know what to think. He doesn't even know what to think anymore. <laughs> so I don't care. You and Joker just just go have some babies. He never expected <laughs> his ship AI to time. become romantically <laughs> invested with his ship fun, pilot. He probably will too. <laughs> then the outcome is an unknown quantity, but you are saying I should attempt it anyway. Nobody ever fell in love without being a little bit brave. You're also an AI. This is what I believe you have improved my chances, Shepard. Thank you. This is so sad. This is like if this is like all the people who played Halo 3 and wanted Cortana to have an actual human body. <laughs> and it's like, well, you know, we we have our own game now. We can do anything. Gosh. Ooh, shotgun. Ooh, assault rifle. Eh. You should buy all of the things nope. for shotgun and assault rifle. You already bought like three upgrades for the assault rifle. Why wouldn't you buy two more? Hey, Commander, check it out. Big news. The Blasto movie is breaking opening week records. There's also a big expose on Quasar tournaments. Tips on how to make your apartment look bigger. And, oh yeah, a big-ass Reaper invasion. These people have no idea. I was about to say that Joker <laughs> needs to pay attention to what's going on. But Joker, Joker's on the level. 
You know what? You know what, Joker? I'm happy for you. You and Edie, you you get out of this okay. You will be the future of the human race. <laughs> when big events shake up the galaxy, people cling to what's familiar. You say that like it's a good thing. It's better than riots in the streets. I guess. I just wish there were a middle ground. You know, a little less gardening advice, a little more war prep. It'll happen. Once there's something people can do to help. Well, these jokers lampshading for me, so... The unshackled AI walking around the Presidium. The unshackled nude AI. No, no, <laughs> mobility assistance net. Thanks to Vrolic Syndrome, I'm legally entitled to bring her everywhere. Finally getting some use out of those disability benefits. I'm sure she appreciates getting out to see the sights. Ah, she's earned a little shore leave. She's a robot. They don't have feelings. Oh, you would sensitive racist citrus. You, you wouldn't be attracted to her if she was in one of those military robots, like the huge like mech we fought on Eden Prime. How do you know? Maybe he would. Maybe Joker is more, more emotionally attached than you will ever be. Really? He just got put to shame. You think if Ed showed up in one of those mechs and was like, "Hello, Joker. Character. How are you?" Mech three. Where is the friggin' CSEC office? I I can't handle this. I can't handle this anymore. <laughs> before the before my party members couldn't walk around the citadel without me, and now they're just hanging around. They don't even wait for my permission. Man, when did I lose control of everything? I don't even have my own ship. It's like full of all alliance crap. <laughs> 